see in my mind this is the most dominant force in the MMA game today. The undisputed UFC lightweight champion, your AKA teammate, Khabib Nurmagomedov. Yeah, for Khabib, it's the well-rounded skill set that has propelled him to one of the longest undefeated streaks in mixed martial arts history. No missteps, no mistakes, no underestimation of opponents. Always prepared, always ready to go, and he can rely on his the coaching he gets, also on the ability that he has to carry him to victory time and time again. Wrestling, samba, jujitsu. So here we go, this highly anticipated fight is now underway. Looks like a classic matchup of striker versus grappler. Am I simplifying things too much? In this instance, you aren't, because this is what got these two men to the show. Right. One guy is known for his diverse attack on the feet. The other guy is known for his ability to drag the fight to the mat and put his opponents in danger from the very start of the grappling exchange. Perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the fan. Oh, he's feeling it now. Nice combination there by Nurmagomedov. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch landed. Oh, counters with an overhand left. He stuck that one. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Misses again with a right punch. That right hand hurt him a little bit. All right, so one minute into the fight, and I'm not sure these fighters realize that we got three or five rounds to No healing out process at all. From the moment this fight started, these two gentlemen were ready to knock each other's heads off. Effective oh. punch there. Effective lead right hand there by Nurmagomedov. Connects with the right hand. Pretty good punch, that one. Nice right punch by this young man. Beautiful body kick. Well, you start to really worry about the wrestling, and there's that left hand from Cubby. Underrated. I mean, it's a very underrated part of his game, his ability to stand and strike with anybody in the UFC. 26 total strikes have now landed for Khabib Nurmagomedov. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Just missed with the left there. And he landed the right hand there. Nice straight punch. Just misses with the left hook. All right, he lands a hook there, DC. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. When you throw a hook, it can go around the guard of your opponent. Oh, and he caught the kick. And a nice stiff jab there. I mean, he's cutting him down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, a huge block there. Under two minutes now to go in the round. Just missing on the uppercut there. Oh, look at him land another jab there. He's certainly using that weapon effectively here tonight. The most effective weapon in all of boxing, in all of combat sports, is a jab. This young man has a knowledge of using it like no one else. All right, so he lands a jab there. Pretty nicely done, DC. You can really control a fight just knowing how to fight behind your jab. Real sneaky body kick. A glancing right hand upstairs. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Mago Medoff gets caught with that punch. What a tricky head kick. Under a minute to go. Let's go, you can do this. Keep going forward. 45.
five seconds remain in the round. Over and over, he's landing that big body kick. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Straight right hand now just misses. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Can't take many of those. Better check. Five minutes in the books. All right, that horn signifies the end of the round. Let's take this through some replays, champ. And the replays are going to be kicks. That's the story of this fight to this point. He is landing these kicks at will, just driving his shin into his opponent's legs, and it's really starting to slow him down. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. He just continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively protecting the head and sort of maybe letting his opponent gas out a little bit with all the volume. His opponent sees the target, but he can't get to the target. So he'll continue to throw, and he'll continue to wear on his own gas. Ooh, that uppercut landed for him. And just misses with that big right hand. Oh, straight right. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Ooh, big shot, man. Lands flush with that right hand. Very tricky when you throw that body. All right, so there he goes, continuing to land that jab. When they put this highlight together, it's just going to be one head snapping back. It's going to be boxers going back and watching this guy and going, wow, this is what a jab is supposed to look like. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Big, powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Leg kick. Nurmago Medov's kick to the body. That one blocked by the defense. Oh, and a nice jab by him there, and that's going to give his opponent some problems if that keeps landing. He's having a tough time getting his offense going because that jab is just stopping him every time. Nice jab by him there. He's going nose hunting tonight, huh? Yeah, he's great with the jab. And not only as a setup, he really is trying to get damage off every time he throws this punch. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here and as a result has really picked up the pace in round two. Oh, thought he might have had that head kick, but just out of range. Come on, hey. You wonder if the offensive fighter is going to start to get frustrated here. Most stiffed on all of these shots are getting blocked. They're getting blocked because he's fighting one of the best defensive fighters in the UFC. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations here. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may throw the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into the strike. Really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Oh, that's a nice strike. Oh, nice slip there. It sounds simple, right? Hit and don't get hit, but this guy's defense has been sharp tonight. Cat and mouse, you gotta play cat and mouse. Hit, don't get hit. He does a great job of that. Oh, nice check on the leg kick offering there. He loaded up with that right hand, too. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, 
Well, there's that patented heavy leg kick. So a good job defensively by him here as he raises the guard and prevents any damage. Shades of James Tony, always seeing things coming at him. He's such a great defensive fighter. Big kick lands. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. Certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Nice punch lands over the top. 15 seconds. He throws the right hand there. Oh, beautiful jab by him there. Got that to the target quickly. He's dictating the fight with a jab. Two rounds in the books. All right, well, his kicking game was outstanding in that round. We'll see if his opponent can make the adjustments, but take us through the replays before we get there. It's always weird to watch a young fighter start to come into his own. Early in his career, he did not have this ability. He did not have the ability to dictate and control fights with his legs. Now he does, and he looks like a future champion in the making. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take their turn. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick. And watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Got him whip his hip into that kick. There's no tell on that leg kick. Big punch lands through the middle. Oh, that's a nice strike there by Nurmagomedov. Romero. Yeah, Habib Nurmagomedov is not only a wrestler, he's a full-on mixed martial artist now, and it showed in that exchange. That was a thudding leg kick. He's looking to land the right, just out of range. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Well, it didn't take long. You see the side oh. of the oh. 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 there, DC, and one more of those, he might get. I mean, the fight is gonna be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Overhand punch to the head, blocked though by Nurmagomedov. Oh, big punch land. Glancing right hand lands upstairs. Just misses with the jump. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Another shot to the body, beautifully placed as he continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Visibly limping here. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Big body kick. All right, so a nice job there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be, and if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Slips. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. You can feel that breeze octagon side after the swing and a miss by Nurmago Medoff. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. <laughs> oh, 
just unable to quite find that range. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Head off the center line, slips the punch. Able to check that kick as well. Nice. Oh, big head kick. Get him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Hands on your face. Nice loop at once. Oh, that is as big a strike as he has landed thus far tonight. Big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough his opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. That right hand is on point. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Just misses with the straight right. Effective strike there by Nermako Medov. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that one. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting him over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. All right, next round is now underway. I thought there was pretty good Ready? back and forth action Ready? in the previous frame. Yes, it wasn't a far fight. It wasn't two guys throwing the kitchen sink at each other. But you did see times when it came together and you saw the skill level of these two fighters. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Big kick lands. Punches plus. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton, and to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. Good jab. Well, you don't want to say Khabib has fallen in love with his striking, but he certainly is boxing more than he did early on in his UFC career. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Well, defense doesn't necessarily win championships in MMA, but he's doing a nice job blocking these shots. He's not allowing his opponent to get any damage off him by blocking all these attacks. Mago Medov gets absolutely melted by that head kick. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Shot is blocked. Nice straight right, Lance. Nice body. Great punch landed with so much power. Both fighters throwing heat now. Real quick leg kick. Checks that leg kick. Beautiful jab there, man. It's like you know what's coming, can't stop it. I mean, you have to anticipate that jab coming or he will batter and cruise you with that single strike. Nice strike. Just misses with the jab there. There's no give on that leg kick. Oh, thunderous leg kick on it. Went it a little bit, tried to stay upright, but man, that changed the complexion of this fight. Johnny's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh, 
Magomedov gets tagged by that stiff jab. Liver oh, kick. nice combination of kicks once again. Oh, such a natural jab, and there it is again as he gets the hand right to the target. I mean, right to the target, John. It's like the dude sitting there with a red target on his nose, just getting beat up, hit bullseye after bullseye after bullseye. I love his ability to faint once and then throw that jab right behind it. It's nasty. Straight punch lands. Take more of these leg kicks. You will not be able to be very active on your feet. That's a pretty good right hand there by your teammate, Khabib Nurmagomedov. You're so worried about the wrestling that when the hands come, you're not expecting it. Khabib lands early and he lands off. He's found his range. Now he's in a rhythm landing this nice, beautiful punch. Huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. That's a big strike right there. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Beautiful leg kick thrown. Whoa, whoa, he lands and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Oh, huge block. His leg is hurt here. You can see him limping a little bit. Oh, man, I think you jumped out of your seat a little bit after that kick. Oh, I did, because I had time driving a kick like that. I'll tell you one thing, it does not feel good. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Big punch land. Ooh. And there's the buzzer indicating the end of round two. All right, so there is the horn at times in that previous round. I didn't think we'd get here after that head kick nearly had him out of it. It was a good round leading up to that. But when you take a head kick like that, when your opponent gets your entire body into that kick, usually the night's over. Very tough to still be standing, but he can't take many more like that. You ready? You ready? Fifth and final round. Like he might have landed there instead. A swing and a miss by Numago Metal. Some nice power there with the left hook upstairs. Numago Metal gets hit with yet another left to the head. That's a big target, and the opponent landed it. Nice punch there. Nice. Beautiful body. Big leg kick land. And he caught the kick. Back to the jab now, no good. Flush right hand is true. He is throwing a fast, straight car jab. That's not a feeler jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. Great punch. Defensively as he blocks the shot. Good series of strikes for him there, staying busy and staying accurate. I mean, the accuracy is unbelievable. Back to the feet now. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Oh, and he lands it off. Still attached to his body. The last time I saw an uppercut like that, it was Overeem versus Ngannou. And you know they still haven't found Alistair Overeem's head. Perfect. He's hurt. He's Just hurt. over three minutes now to go in the fight. Beautiful strike. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Another shot lands upstairs. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Big body kick lands. Oh, nice right hand counter. 
Oh, and he caught the kick. And there comes the separation now. Beautiful punch. Oh, and he's back up again. Nice leg kick. Got clipped with the right hand. Leg kick, check finder by Medov. Oh, and he caught the kick. Looks like his leg, you can even see him limping a little bit. Under two minutes now to go in the fight. Straight right hand. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Straight right, he misses. Punch over the top. Oh, an obvious limp there. His leg hurting for certain. Now to go in the fight. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. What a body kick. Knee to the body. Wow. Powerful leg kick lands. Nice punch lands over the top. Wow. Wow. What a fight. Well, it's not every day in the UFC that you see a fight ended due to a leg kick, but that one was absolutely devastating. He took away that lead leg of his opponent, who became a one-legged fighter, and then it became just a matter of time. So somewhat anticlimactic here tonight, but not for the winner, as he gets one of the bigger TKO wins of his UFC career. Seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets...